the United Breweries uh, Heineken deal and um, let's uh, talk a little bit more about what's happened there. Uh, essentially, um, the, the two entities, uh, UB as well as Heineken, have actually uh, reached a pact cementing their alliance and resolving some of their uh, previous uh, differences. Now, we've seen the UB uh, stock reacting. UB holdings there up uh, more than 4% uh, in trade. Let's also bring up uh, some of the other stocks uh, which are listed in that space. And uh, let's understand a little bit more this story with Heineken, with our ET Now research analyst, uh, Vishal Bhargav. So, Vishal, now this has been an alliance that's been brewing for quite a while, so to speak. But now that the deal has been cemented, when we talk about numbers, what does it really mean on both sides? Well, essentially, firstly, Parmat, I'll, ju I'll, ju I'll just give you the broad contours of what this deal really means. Uh, essentially, what you will see is uh, UB distributing Heineken beer exclusively from their from the distribution network. Now, I'll just give you a brief background what essentially was the cause of the dispute. Because what essentially happened was Heineken had a 42.5% stake in APB India. And, and the suspicion was that essentially through APB India, Heineken, uh, Heineken would start would start distributing its beer. Now, now the deal, according to the latest deal agreement that was worked out between both the companies, uh, the Heineken will be acquiring APB India and then transferring these three businesses to, uh, to United Breweries in 2000. Now, why is that so important? It's essentially one because uh, the fear of, of of APB India distributing Heineken network, Heineken beer goes away. The other is the brands that APB India essentially had, which included the likes of uh, the Tiger beer as well as Heineken as well as Anchor. They were in direct competition to Kingfisher as as such. So now, after these businesses are transferred to United Breweries, this major competition to like, United Breweries goes away. So that's a, that's a key story that essentially comes out in terms of United Breweries as well as Heineken deal. Of course, the benefit in terms so distribution to, uh, to both the companies is immense. We actually know for a fact that United Breweries has about half the half the market share in India when it comes to beer. So UB will essentially benefit from the distribution network. Uh, uh, Heineken, will, Heineken will benefit from the distribution network that UB has in India, and and vice versa because because the global footprint that Heineken has is immense. So the Kingfisher brand will also benefit from the fact that Heineken has such has, has such a good uh, global footprint. So both these companies gain in terms of global footprint as well as domestic footprint because we know Kingfisher is dominant in domestically and, and Heineken is dominant globally. So, th so that will be the one element they will benefit from. What essentially is going to happen in terms of Heineken, apart from this, is they will essentially get a bigger say in terms of how UBL as an entity is run. Just to give you the shareholding pattern currently of United Brewers holding, it's about a 37.5% holding that is there by United Breweries as well as by, by Vijay Malia and Associates and 37.5% is owned by, by Heineken itself. So that's a key element. Now after this, uh, Heineken can actually, uh, can actually nominate three directors to the board including one CFO so that's the one element that comes out in terms of governance that Heineken will start playing into a much greater role when it comes to United Breweries in, in, in terms of numbers we actually, actually know actually the type of monopoly the near type monopoly that rather uh, United Breweries has uh, just to give you some numbers in the first half of 2009 what we have seen is that the growth that uh, UBL has seen it's been 16% versus an industry growth of 8% so it's been a double the industry growth so that's essentially the big theme that's coming out in terms of United Breweries Heineken, Heineken deal essentially a big competition has essentially been shelved off by United Breweries.